and beautiful like I used to. Hello. Hey, what's up? Who's, what's your name? I'm Aaron. How are you doing? Good, Aaron. You got to sit up for us, okay? I'm sitting up. Okay. Aaron, where are you calling me from? I'm calling from New York. New York? What part? Uh, Bronx, New York, 10 minutes Bronx. from Harlem. Bronx, New York, 10 minutes from Harlem? Correct. How old are you? I'm 40. 40 years old. Um, do you have any children? Not at all. Celebrity hairstylist, makeup artist, celebrity model, and singer. And singer. So celebrity hairstylist, makeup artist, and singer. All right, give me 20 seconds real quick. You are so beautiful to me. Kendra, can't you see? See? Ooh. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, Aaron. All right. Aaron, so I don't want to be disrespectful, so you got to help me out, okay? Are you a trans man? Not at all. Okay. Strictly, strictly dickly male. <laughs> Okay, so you're gay. Meaning, yes, definitely. Okay, okay, definitely. okay, okay. Just okay. beautiful. I looked like a female until I was 15. Okay, but you date men? Definitely. No surgery, none of that. No surgery, none of that. Got you. All right, thank okay. you for clarifying. So this is Aaron, New York, Bronx. How old? He's 40 years old. When's your birthday, Zodiac sign? May 6th. Oh, you're a Taurus. Taurus, exactly. Yes. My exactly. birthday's May 7th. Right. So your birthday is the same day as Meek Mill. Definitely. <laughs> and yo, real talk, real talk. I said, let me just press this button while I'm here because I'm getting ready to go out to sing. And lo and behold, you came on right away and I followed the show. So I said, let's make sure I look all right. Da, 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 da. And have everything together. You understand oh. what I'm talking about? Wait a minute. I wasn't ready for the voice change. Love has played its games on me so long. I started to believe I'll never find anyone. And i just try to convince me to give in, but to love you, you. Come on. Okay. So, yeah, I got some good people right now working with me, so I'm excited. I sang back up for Fantasia. I'll open for Yolanda Adams by myself. Okay, listen, I love you, Aaron, but you know this is a dating show. so you Got it, ready? got it, got it, got okay. it, got it. Okay, so let's got get it. into it. So what kind of man are you looking for? Uh, One that can handle his own, got his own stuff like I do, and that's good. As long as you can take care of yourself, I'm good. Everything else, we can make money together like I did in the past with others, so... Okay. As long as you got your own stuff, you don't need to borrow a Metro card. You don't need five dollars. Da 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 da. I'm good. That's all. Okay. Okay. And yes, all real, all natural and real. Oh, that's your real hair. My natural hair, baby. Natural. Oh, I it was a wig. No, not at all. Everybody, Wait, put you know, come through it. I'm not gonna comb my hair right now, baby. Come okay, on. Put your fingers through it. It's it's kinky. It's it's nappy. I just like woke up. I just okay. Woke up. Cause I was, I look, trust me, I, trust me. It's, I was gonna ask you where you got that wig from. It's beautiful. No, it used to be a little long. I just cut it like about three months ago. Okay, okay, boo. All right. So now, Aaron, besides wanting to borrow money from you, what's some deal breakers for you? Uh, I usually don't have no drama, and I hear females are getting all drama. In the past, I had Bloods, Crips, uh, uh, Latin Kings that I found out, and I said like, yo. You ever put your hands on me, you're going to get the frying pan. So I've never had no drama. Aaron, Aaron, start from the beginning because I went out for a second. We got over 8,000 people, and I was trying to screenshot. So I need you to do me a favor. I'm going to ask you the question again, your deal breakers, because you was getting juicy. You said you don't do no drama. Right. No okay, drama. Okay, so, so tell me again. Right. No drama at all. And I've dated some rough dudes or whatever and boom teddy bear around me da 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 so no drama a lot of people keep coming to me saying oh i got a girlfriend i got a wife i said well let me talk to her and tell her what you're doing so right exactly so right i'll so be like I, i'm never gonna be number two never ever gonna be down in the secret dl is for dumb loser i don't play that game come on boo i don't play that game i'm too amazing 
So you can't walk with me down the block, 125th Street, as I've done in the past, then goodbye, you know? So I'm more so important than that. Date, um, would you date a transgender woman or man? Not at all, not at all. And okay. I have a, I have a 18 year old. That happened, you know, a while back. I asked if you had any kids. You said no. I didn't. I didn't hear you. I didn't hear that part. And I, a okay, girl so you said, have a child. "Right." I told her I was gay, and she said, "I don't care. I want your genes. I don't care about all that. You talented. Da da da. They, I'm five. I'm like six feet. I'm six feet tall." And I'm a former Albanelli dancer as well, so I'm in shape. So I'm just saying, I just, I'm focused. I put all my energy into positive stuff, and if the negativity is around, see ya, bye. That's all. Oh, oh, okay. So if you just tuned in, this is Erin in New York, Bronx, 40 years old, celebrity hairstylist, makeup artist, and a singer, um, gay male. So just because I'm nosy, your child, did you create it via the sexual act, or was you a sperm donor? Uh, it was a sexual act, you know, blah, blah, blah. You know, try it. You might like it. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> like it. <laughs> you didn't like it. All right. I didn't like Does your guy it. have to look a certain way? Uh, just in fit and make sure every part is accurate. You know what I mean. That's all. No, what does that mean? Well, I don't try to do small, medium. I need large, da, 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 da. And it's just, a lot of people don't want to say that, but it's, I want the full circle. And if you are a Christian, such as I am, you can have it all. You can have everything. You can have the looks. They can have the money. They can have the right body parts that you're attracted to. And that's why people are cheating, because they're getting with people who they don't really like. It's something to do. But if you get with your dime, your Michelle Obama, your Beyonce and Jay-Z, can nothing compare. Can nothing compare. So okay. you get with somebody who's full circle. Okay. So do they gotta make a certain amount of money? Not at all. Like I said, as long as they can take care of themselves. Uh, Kendra, sidekick. I'm coming out with waterproof hair. Already started the uh everything. I'm coming okay. out with everything. Water. I'm a stylist too. Hairstylist, makeup artist. So. I know. I said that in the beginning, but let's continue with your. What you right. looking for your man? Okay. Got you. Okay. So, Erin, when was your last relationship? About 10 years ago. 10 so, Erin, I challenge that because cause you just said a second ago, you want, you got to be big in the bedroom. So, for 10 years, you've been single. Do you think the size really matters? It does when a lot of people come to you and they just want to play in the pool, but they don't want to take no responsibility. So, but, and that's a two-way But they say sometimes the men with the big penis don't like being faithful to one person. That's what they say sometimes. Well, I've had three of them, and they was faithful for over three years, so. Then why are you not with them right now? Because when they stepped out on me, I said goodbye. I look at you a different way. I don't trust you no more. You broke the trust while right, I was working. Right, but it's fair enough to say that eventually they, they travel somewhere else, correct? No, I traveled out the country. I mean, they, what I mean is they cheated on you with somebody else. Right, correct. So With a friend, with a friend. With a friend? Yeah, so, you know, it got a little ugly, but... But uh, three different guys cheating with you on a friend or different situations? Three different situations, and two of them was with friends. Okay. Well, right. listen, it's, it's your world, it's your preference, but so let's just keep going. Of course. Um, Aaron, you don't got to answer this question, but I'm going to ask, when's the last time you was intimate with someone? Two weeks ago. So is this guy an option? Maybe, definitely. It's a possibility, but I can't push a car by myself. It has to be what they're thinking. So, okay. you know, we got to be on the same plane. So, but I let them know how I felt and everything. And we'll see what happens. But you got to have a couple of irons in the fire. And okay. see which one latches on and hooks up. That's all. Because the guy have kids. Oh, yeah, definitely. definitely. All right. Does he have to be in New York? Probably that'd be nice. Uh, anywhere outskirts, Pennsylvania, Jersey, all good. And, all right. And what's so, you're you're forty? What's the age range you want to date? Uh, forty up to sixty, because usually older guys know how to treat people and they settle. They're not trying to run around everywhere and get this and get that. You know, when they say when you get forty five, fifty, you know what you want. 
So, yeah, uh, young is uh, just running around. They don't know what they want. You know, they're figuring life out. So once you get to a point and you know exactly what you like, you want, it's a better chance of okay. making something work. That's all. This, listen, I'm going to take your word for it, but they're adamant that your hair is a wig. I don't care. It's okay. I've been on the show before. I, I be ratting and raving, too, when I see something. So it's all good. Okay. All okay. right, Aaron, it's time for Kendra Cam. You got to stand up so we can see your full body. Okay, I'm standing up in my bed. Hold on. Ooh, no, 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 no. That'd be funny if I bust my ass. Oh, you got boobs too, Aaron? Yes, I do, baby. And they're natural. I used Those to be are... fat. I used to be fat, lost weight, started working out. Oh, and now you want to call me, you want, you want me to pull them down too and see that and investigate? <laughs> no, no, no. But can you put the phone down so and then like stand to the back so we can see your full body? Whoop, whoop, child. What's going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Aaron, you put it on your butt. Keep I got phone. ass, everything. I got ass, body, six pack, flat stomach. Okay. okay. Aaron, I would say, can you put the phone down somewhere and then stand from the back oh. so we can see? You mean stand up? Yeah, stand up. Are so y'all like really trying stands. to put me through? Oh, you know what? You the only person that could ever do this because dudes be asking me all kind of stuff. I'll be like, you are not worthy, but yes, Kendra, I'm on the Kendra train, so I'll be like, okay, what you want done? <laughs> I'm on the Kendra train. Okay, okay. Well, you know, we see you, Aaron. We see. We got you. Exactly. All right, so, Aaron, we got a couple more questions. Why do you think you're single? Because I won't settle for anything. I've had the best before. I had the best. And what, what happened to the best that you had? The best I found out six months they was married. Then that's the not the best you ever had. They was no, married. that's no, that's one of the best. And then the other best stepped out on me. We was gonna go down the aisle. I Why are you saying that parents. these people are the best? And they first of all, the person that was married was alive from the jump. So you see, right? Them but I didn't know part. that. I didn't know right, that. Right, you didn't know that, but they knew that. So why would you consider them being one of because your best? Because everything else was nice. The cordial, what you need, let me take care of this, da, da, da. You need that, what you need, da. Everything was nice. Everything was that fairy tale. And that's well, exactly what it was, a fairy tale. That's why right, I nice. Right, but as far as outside of being married or cheating on me, everything was fine up until that point. There was no drama, fighting, screaming, all that crap. None of that. I hear you. I, I, I just I just want to challenge your thoughts because you are presented a fantasy and you and you use that as a you're using that as a scale to compare to other people that could potentially come to you wholesome and in a real way. This person presented you a fantasy from the beginning. So I just challenge you considering that one of your best relationships. Because if that's the case, then you need to just continue to date married men that in their free time. Exactly, you don't want to, right? You don't want to. But what I'm saying is that person probably, he was, he was living a double life. Right. But real talk, they keep coming. They keep coming to, oh, I'm seeing somebody. Oh, I got a girlfriend. I'm like, yo, this shit is crazy. And I, and I say, being that you told me, I know I don't get involved. I don't get involved. I'd be like, yo. I know. Once you know, you can't say nothing. Once you know, you can't say nothing. But when you don't know, it's another story. So right now, the other thing is, I'm saying focus on the, my music, the hair, makeup, inventions, all of that. So until somebody right, make me snap out of it. And like I said, they don't have to be rich, wealthy, all that. Da, 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 da. Just be, okay. just make me flutter when you walk in that room. That's it. And get me and I get you and da, da, da. That's it. And okay, that's we, got, we got one more question, Aaron. Why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Because when we are together, I'm a brainstorm. I'm a brainstorm and find other benches for us to work together. I find that when you have a working relationship, such as Obama and Michelle, Jay-Z, Beyonce, it keeps you more focused and in tune and it's harder to walk away. It's not just a love relationship, but we also make money and enjoy doing businesses and changing people's lives and da da da. So it's more. It's more than you have more. 
more to offer. And putting that time in together says a lot because a lot of people don't want to be with their spouse 24. So listen, listen, I feel you on that. Listen, I'm the, I'm the president of the Beehive chapter in Chicago. That's how much I love Beyonce. And I really love that Beyonce was vulnerable enough to let the world know that she went through infidelities in her marriage. But Beyonce decided to stay. So you just said you want something like Jay-Z and Beyonce. But you know Beyonce stuck by her husband when he cheated on her. So are you saying you could stick by your man if he cheats on you? Because you already said you couldn't do that. Check this out. My mindset, the body changes every seven years. So my mindset back then, that's what it was. No. So now if we have business and we have more things going on, of course, I'd be like, okay, I get a free pass. I'll let you know. Like, yo, if I see Brad Pitt, it's going to go down. I might Brad even take pictures. Whatever. I will take pictures. I'm just saying it's going to go down and don't say nothing. But outside of that, hopefully that bond is strong enough where you don't have that desire. You got to yeah. be every, like the song says, I'm every woman. You have to be every person that your spouse is desiring. Okay, you ain't got to okay. go to the streets. I'm going to be everything that you want. You want to play doctor? You want to play pimp, pick up prostitute? You want to play, oh, I'll come into the bar by myself and you pick me. We could play all of that. And that's it. And sometimes people are afraid to ask their spouse for uh, role playing. That's all. Got you. Okay. Well, let's do it. And this is Aaron in New York. Does the person got to be in New York? Uh, most likely, that'd be nice. Anywhere in the five boroughs, New York or the five boroughs, Bronx, Queens, Brooklyn, da, 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 da. Okay. All of that. Um, he's 40 years old, celebrity hairstylist. Your, your age range again was what, 40 to 60? 40 to 60, yeah. 40 to 60. There's, some my... young, there's some young 60 year old. There's some young. There's some young 60 and 50 years old, but just try not to look 60. Ooh, try not to look 60 is the key. Um, celebrity your styles, makeup artist, and singer. All right, Erin, give them your Facebook page. Erin Williams uh, uh, Facebook page. I look at that more than the Instagram and more than everything else. Okay. Erin, before you go, give us one more song, 20 seconds. <laughs> There's a spark of magic in your eyes in candy land of years each time you smile i never thought that fairy tales come true but they come true oh when i'm near Hope that you by golly want you. You're the one, Kendra, I've been waiting for forever. Uh... <laughs> Come on, when I throw that bass in there, they lose it. They lose it. <laughs> oh my God. I sing in the tri state area, so people probably see me a few times. Oh All right, Aaron, I love you. We I'm gonna write you a theme song. I'm gonna write. I'm gonna sing and write a theme song for your, just okay. for you, okay. just for your show, just you. I'm gonna make it sassy and everything with all the stuff that you do. Okay, I appreciate you, Aaron. Keep me posted how it goes, baby. Definitely, and thank you so much. And look, I have friends from different walks, and nobody talks about you, but then when they bring your name up, they say, "Oh yeah, I watch that too. Oh yeah, you said that one." And boom, it's an instant table conversation. Oh, right, thank so. you so much. The definitely. show is Come definitely on. growing. I appreciate all the people that definitely. are supporting, telling their friends about it. It's really a word of mouth spreading, so I love all you guys. Thank you, Aaron. Bye, baby. Thank you. And I was at your 3,000 show. I was there for your 3,000 when you made 30,000, yeah, 30,000, 300,000, something like that. Oh, 300,000, yeah. Right, on I was Instagram. there. Come we, on. Well, we still grow. We like it. Oh, come on, boo. You're going to have your own TV show. I see it in the future. You're going to be boss lady. You're going to be more boss lady. And I love when you put them in your place. You do it so classy and gentle, but then sometimes you snap. I said, yes, yes. <laughs> Keep working it. Keep doing what you're doing. You can't do no wrong. Thank you. I received that. Thank you. You're Aaron. welcome. Taurus is in the house. Taurus is in the house. In the house. Bye, baby. I love you. Bye, <laughs>
<laughs> Y'all wasn't ready for air tonight, baby. Y'all was not ready. This Facebook show is going to be hard to top. 